take a listen to what he said. When it, when it comes to aliens, uh, there are some things I just can't tell you uh, on air. But what, what is true, uh, and I'm, I'm actually being serious here, is, is that uh, there are, uh, there's footage and records of objects in the skies that we don't know exactly what they are. We can't explain uh, how they moved, their trajectory. Uh, they, they did not have um, an easily explainable pattern. And so, you know, I, th- I think that we're, uh, people still take seriously trying to investigate and figure out what that is. That was Leo. On March 5th, 2004, the Mexican Air Force recorded footage of 11 UFOs at 11,500 feet above southern Campeche State. Surrounding a military jet, these lights were detected during a routine search for drug traffickers. Jets pursued the UFOs, but eventually gave up and the objects disappeared. While some believe this was the work of flares, explanations also range from ball lightning to a meteorite deteriorating in Earth's atmosphere. Whatever these objects were, infrared equipment operator Lieutenant Mario Adrian Vasquez is convinced that they were, quote, completely real. Pilot Major Magdaleno Castañón went so far as to suggest that the UFOs knew they were being pursued. Number four, the Aguadilla Airport incident. Salute, salute, man. Today, we're going to talk about some real shit real quick. Let those who have wisdom understand. Now, in today's society... You know what I'm saying? They start to really realize that there is, you know, things out there other than ourselves, which they call UFOs and aliens and all of that stuff. Right. But let me make something clear so that you understand the truth. If you see something of a ship or something like that, nine times out of ten, that's made by men. But when you see orbs of light that move like this and can't be explained and they just shoot off and take off at the speed of light. And you see these orbs that people think are physical objects. You know what I'm saying? But what they are are angels or they are demons. Okay? When you see these orbs of light in the sky and it be like four or five of them and then they light up. And then they come back to minimal light. Then they bright up. Then they move this way, that way. And then they take off the speed of light. Those are angels or demons. It even says in the Bible that Satan comes as an angel of what? Light, right? So angels are made from fire. Angels are light. Angels be in the presence of God. God is light. They are light. They're not aliens or anything like that okay what they are they're angels and they're demons now the demons are deceiving the human race to believe that there are other planets with they are but they're in tune you know what i'm saying these are demons that are deceiving the human race because in the end time this is what's going to be the great deception When they talk about an antichrist and all of that stuff, this is going to be it. And it's got the world fooled about aliens and all of that stuff like that. When it's actually the war, spiritual warfare going on between angels and demons. Okay. And it's all about us. Okay. There are no little green men or nothing like that. They may deceive you and Come into the form of something like that to deceive you. But this is the great controversy between Yahweh and Satan. God and Satan. This is what it is. So don't be fooled to think that it's like aliens and stuff like that. Now listen to me. Jimmy Carter, when he was president, he sent out messages to the universe. This is our music. This is our language. You can look it up, bro. Jimmy Carter sent messages out to the universe. This is our language. This is our culture. This is who we are. So even those that don't believe in demons, right? So let's say, for instance, there are demons. Demons say, okay, let's deceive the shit out of them. You feel me? You see the deception? Okay, it says in the Bible, 
The skies will be for signs. Signs. If this is not a sign, then what is? 50 years ago, it wasn't so much activity with this. It was just like, well, is it true or is it not? And you've seen a little footage. Now you see it every day. And the government has even admitted that, yes, there are all these things that's going around that they can't understand. But let those who have wisdom understand. God says my people are destroyed for the lack of knowledge. Understand what's going on. How many times Hollywood make these movies. V and, 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 and Predator and Alien. I could, there's a thousand different Alien movies. Some of them are good. Some of them are bad. And they're only conditioning your mind to get ready for when they do finally come down. And demons come down. And they deceived human, human mankind. <coughs> okay. This is all a big setup. So when they finally do come down. After you done watch so many movies. And there's good aliens. And there's bad aliens. They're conditioning you. For when it really happens. For when these demons come in the form of these so called aliens. And they come down and mix with the human race. Okay, they condition you with all these movies. You feel me? And then when they when they finally come down, they go into the sea. Now they got alien cults, right? People that worship aliens. Yeah, yeah, they got alien cults. You can look it up. They got a a, a alien entity named Aster, and you got people that worship Aster, right? Now listen. Every time there's a a alien entity, know what they do? They always preach a different Yahshua, a different Jesus. Okay? They take you away from what the Bible says. Don't this look like the work of demons when they doing that? You feel me? Bro, don't be deceived. You got to really know what's going on. It's about to happen. When they talk about the Antichrist is coming, you know what I'm saying? It's going to happen through this, through this alien so-called contact with mankind. You see it all the time. All you got to do is just look and you know it's official. You saw all these orbs of light, you know what I'm saying, fleets of orbs of, of light, which are angels or demons. You even some see some videos when they fighting each other in the heavens. You know what I'm saying? So don't be deceived by this. Understand what it is. It's spiritual warfare. It says in the Bible that there'll be frightening signs in the sky. Know what I'm saying? Frightening signs in the sky. And if this is not it, come on. This is the end time. This is the real deal. For those who have wisdom, let them understand, bro. Wake up. Look and see what's going on. Know what I'm saying? <sighs> They conditioning you, man. All these alien movies, bro. They conditioning your mind. You people not even they bro. This shit is real. You have to understand that. Yo, I got a interview coming up with um the most official blood at Lady Brim, aka Tatted Barbie, and she not only official and thorough, but she's a baddie too. And that's going to come up. I'm going to drop the interview on Sunday. Facts. We're going to do it. You know what I'm saying? Put it down. It's going to be my first interview. And I want to set up, you know, a platform for official thorough ladies to come on. You know what I'm saying? I'm inviting you to come on and, um, Get interview, get to get it off your chest, whatever you want to talk about. You know what I'm saying? Facts. So that's what I got planned for the future. You know what I'm saying? Salute L Breezy. You know, we're gonna get this uh thing going, man. But um Wake up, bro. See what's going on in this world. It's real, bro. 
And we walking around like it ain't nothing. You know, doing our everyday thing. And there's spiritual warfare going on around us. And, and God is allowing our eyes to be open to see these things where we never used to see them before. 60 years before, you never seen all this, man. Some of them are man-made. You know what I'm saying? But when you see those orbs of light that move at the speed of light in any direction, zip, 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 anything physical can't do that, man. So I just want to give y'all some wisdom, man, so y'all know what time it is, bro. It's your boy, Stony Rockstar, man, and I'll be back at you, and I'm going to get that um interview done. Salute, man. Those that got wisdom understand, bro. TV camera in the Silendrak Town Square, which is a shopping mall in Indonesia. This footage has caused a lot of people to scratch their heads since the first time it was uploaded to the internet. The luminous glowing apparition that appears on the grainy black and white CCTV video certainly has all the hallmarks of being an actual angel, glowing body and wings and all. It stays in frame for a few seconds before flying away, right before mall cops arrived at the scene to check what the thing actually was. Of course, there's a big chance that all this is fake, so I suggest you don't suspend your dis- so loud. Demon screaming in the sky. from up in the air, like up there. It's been going on now. What is that? I swear I saw like this thing when the lightning was flashing a second ago. What the? That is horrible.